Hello my lovely humans and welcome to my channel Dear Human. Um, I'm going to do a quick little haul from things I got from Boohoo. I just wanted to do this video for the other Canadians out there who may have heard about this site or have seen it online and don't know whether or not to trust the quality and the shipping and all of that. So I decided to purchase a couple things just to see whether or not it was worth it. I know a friend who shops from Boohoo quite frequently and she has nothing but good things to say but it never looked like the quality online was that great so you really have to zoom in on the clothes and really be picky about what you're um, buying. So it came today um, in a little plastic bag, it says Boohoo on it. Um, packaging isn't anything remarkable. Um, I've gotten things from ASOS and Misguided, just packaged like that. Um, I don't love that it's packaged like that. I wish it was kind of like Net-A-Porter -Net or Shop Op where they actually take um, a little more of the packaging into consideration. Um, the shipping was very fast and if you buy over a certain amount it's free shipping um, I think and it includes your duties and taxes which is what I like because Misguided and um, ASOS don't do that. Um, also it came very quickly so it says uh, six to eight days and I think it came in four days because I can barely remember when I last purchased it. So the first thing I got was a mesh bodysuit. Um, it's a little inside out. I've already opened it up and tried the things on. I got it in a size four which apparently is uh, a US size four which is a UK eight according to this but I think a UK eight is a U US two because I'm a size two. But I knew I didn't want um, a bodysuit that would be too tight and fitted, which is why I went with this US 4, but this is a size 2. It is really tight and fitted. I like the mesh bodysuit. Um, they, they had some others on there. And also the reason I decided to pick things up now is because they were having, I think it was a 50% off promotion. So I figured um, if I was going to buy something there or test the quality, I might as well do it when there is um, a promotion going on. So it has a soft round neck, which I like, and the actual bodysuit is pretty nice. Um, and it has a little clasps at the bottom. So the actual bodysuit is too small for a US 4. This is not a US 4. It's very tiny. And I got it um, with the cami. So it's a cami and bodysuit mesh bodysuit together because they were selling bodysuits by itself for... Um, a little bit more expensive, but I wanted one to pair with a cami that had a low back and in the picture it had the cami paired with it and the low back and the cami came with it and this is clearly not a size 4. This is like a size 12, 10, 12, like I, my friend is a size 4 and this would be way too big on her. This is um, it's supposed to be UK 8, but I don't know in what world this is a UK 8, so it's super low cut. I've already tried it on under the bodysuit. It's a waste, so I'll have to try and find um, another cami that has a low back to go with it, but at least the bodysuit is fine. Then I got a pleated oh, off-the-shoulder dress in black. Um, I haven't seen a lot of these pleated, like this is popular, but I haven't seen many that are off the shoulder and pleated, and I wanted one in a crinkly pleated material that was flattering. I have pants um, in a nude color like this, and I have one in like a beige matching set, um, a skirt and a top, so why not get a dress? I wanted an easy dress to wear on vacation, um, and that was flattering, and I wouldn't care if it got ruined in the wash. So it's um, floor length, off the shoulder. Um, I like this. This is in a US. Uh, this is in a US two um, because it looked really baggy on the model, which is why I want a, my size. But this is pretty tight at the top at your shoulders, which is good because it won't slip down, which is really annoying with off the shoulder dresses. But it's a little tight which I think if I wore it for many hours it might be uncomfortable so maybe for a night out when I'm on vacation this would be fine but not all day. So the sizing of Boohoo is all over the map. This is the only thing that is true to size so I got a 
cape blazer and it's super wrinkly because they just throw it in a plastic bag. So this is super long, it goes past your knees and you can't really tell what it looks like on but it's just a cape blazer. So I have one in black um, and it's super flattering and I love it and that one was like 60 bucks and this is half the price. Um, and the reason I got it because I knew cape blazers are never cheap even when they're on sale and you get it from an affordable site they're never cheap um, and I really like this nude color and be perfect for work but it's not um, made the best if you can tell there's this section underneath and then the cape part goes over it and that's not normally how cape blazer is made this part is just attached to the seam and then the cape part just kind of hovers over your shoulders but it's like a whole separate section so I just have to be careful when I'm wearing it that I don't lift my arms up too much because then I'll look really awkward and you'll be able to tell the quality of it um, otherwise for the price it was 50% off I would not have bought this for full price I'd actually be pretty mad with the quality if I paid full price for this um, so those are my tips for shopping on sites like this always waiting for a promotion um, and just buying things that you actually like and not just because they're on sale and um, all of the regular price items on sites like this always have a promotion code so if you just wait a little while wait even every couple weeks it doesn't even have to be on promotional times they have coupon codes whether it's 30 40 percent off sometimes 50 I think maybe this may have been 40 percent off not 50 anyways um, I give boohoo a 6 out of 10 um, and I don't know if I would reorder from them again unless they have things that I know I can't get from other sites for the same kind of affordable price and it's for things that I know I'm not gonna wear as often and they're just for one-time looks which is what all of these were I know I'm not gonna wear a mesh bodysuit all the time in a pleated dress um, the cape I will wear more often at work but I don't really care as much what I look like at work so it's okay if the quality is not amazing um, other than that that's my review on boohoo on being a Canadian purchaser thanks for watching